Having a turkey dinner emergency, the people at Butterball have experts standing by. KXY Force Colleen O'Brien is here with the answers to those burning questions. Yeah, and speaking of burning, what do you do if you burn one of your dishes? Or how about if your turkey isn't thawed yet? Or what happens if a family feud breaks out? We have Nancy from Butterball joining us this morning. Nancy, thank you for taking a break from your busy schedule to help our viewers. Oh, you're yeah, welcome. Good morning. Good morning. And you're a 16-year veteran of the Butterball Helpline. I first want to ask you, what is your best piece of advice? To make sure that the turkey is thawed. Okay, and how do we do that? Um, what you want to do is make sure that you thaw your turkey in the refrigerator and you allow four pounds a day for thawing. And if you're in a hurry and you don't have that kind of time, you can always thaw it in the cold water method, which is you're going to put the turkey breast side down in cold water submerge it and allow 30 minutes to pound. So like a 10 pound turkey would take five hours to thaw in the refrigerator or in the cold sink. It's the best way, the safest way, Nancy. Thank it's you. What about the weirdest call you've ever, I'm sure you get a lot of weird calls that you go, why are you even calling me? <laughs> well, you know what? I had a gentleman a couple days ago and he, a friend told him that you roast a turkey um, for every pound you roast it an hour. So that would be like a, his 22 pound turkey would take 22 hours. And we just kind of laughed about that. So, so he got it completely wrong. Yes, he did. And so it was kind of kooky. And tell me about this proposal that you perhaps saved, Nancy. This is my favorite story. Oh, uh, it was such a cute story. This gentleman called up, and he was preparing Thanksgiving tur Day turkey. And he was going to have his girlfriend over with her family and his family gathered around the table. And he wanted to propose to her, but he wanted to hide the ring in the turkey. Oh. Like in the, st <laughs> like in the stuffing. So we gently recommended that he do something like with the wishbone instead, and he was okay with that. And <laughs> did you ever hear if she said yes? No, I don't. <laughs> I hope it was a happy ending. <laughs> I'm sure it was. You have a lot of great advice, Nancy. Uh, what That's can thanks. people do if they want to call you or if they need help from Butterball today? Well, we can call 1-800-BUTTERBALL, or we could, you, they can go on to Butterball.com, and we have people um, with emails. We can also Facebook and Twitter. Okay, Nancy, 16-year veteran of the Butterball Helpline. Yes. You have definitely helped us today. Thank you for joining us this oh, morning. Oh, you're so welcome, and have a happy Thanksgiving. You too, Mike. Okay. <laughs> All right, what a cute interview. What a good idea, the wishbone. So there you go, guys. Put it in the wishbone, and hopefully your wish will come true.